All right, the other day I had a user who, no matter what email he tapped on, it would just spin and spin. It would never display the contents of the email. I couldn't figure out how to get it going. I removed the email, I added it back in, and it would just spin blank. No mail, no message selected. Anyway, the solution was I just needed to wait. It just I guess the network was slow or the guy pad was slow. Actually, the guy had like thousands of emails, so I'm just guessing to parse it all. It took a while. Now, the things I did in the meantime that may have actually kickstarted the whole thing were I rebooted the iPad not just by holding down the button. I held down the power button and the home button for about 10 seconds until I saw the white apple and then I released the buttons. I reset the network settings, which also engaged a reboot. That didn't seem to really do anything. I turned off the mail. like I toggled the mail and toggled it back on. This was in a in an MDM environment, so I couldn't delete the email, but I toggled the mail off and I toggled it back on. I toggled the settings for uh, sync mail for one day, three days, five days, no limit. I set it to just one day. The behavior was just the same as if it was on no limit. Oh, and also I activated Siri because in some online form it said that you have to activate Siri for the email to uh, deliver. That really didn't do anything. And then I also installed Outlook the Outlook app just because I felt like if we demonstrated that the email was working, the user would feel better that at least he could see the emails that he needed. And then, you know, that kind of just made things at ease. And then we had a conversation. <laughs> so maybe you just need to have a conversation, call somebody up, let some time fly by. And then the email eventually will kick in. I also toggled the Wi-Fi off and on to let it go to LTE, to let it go to Wi-Fi. Cause many times that does fix the problem. In this case, it didn't either. For me, what fixed it was just waiting, waiting it out. I also closed and reopened the app and that didn't do much. So I think it was just time and waiting. If you have a different way that you resolve the issue, please put it in the comments below. If waiting it out helped, let people know in the comments as well. Thank you for watching Tech Nuba. Tech Nuba.